Hello and happy Friday to you guys. We are in the car. It seems to be a thing for Fridays. It seems to be. <laughs> We're always on the go, but for whatever reason, the Fridays are always a lot of fun to be able to bring you guys along. So we are actually headed up to the Restoration Hardware Outlet or RH as they have rebranded to. So we are actually on the hunt for a piece of furniture for one of our clients. We've actually got a list of items because <laughs> It tends to be that way, that we have a lot of projects going and we try to just knock them all out at one time. And so, yeah, we've got a little list going of some items. We have things for our own house that we're always on the hunt for. Uh, we've got things for our clients as well. So we're just gonna, we were thinking, oh, we could just call and see if they have a dresser. And I was like, no, I really just wanna go up and actually look around. So it's kind of a treat. It feels like a treat. It does. Even though it's only like 20 minutes from our house, it feels like a treat. So we're gonna take you guys along and see what we find. And I'm I'm in high spirits. I just feel like we're gonna find some fun stuff today. I know. I'm in a spendy mood, which is <laughs> always dangerous. Let's hit the road, Jack, okay? Let's just hit the road. Let's start this Friday with me. Let's go see what they've got at the RH outlet and it's gonna be a great day. Let's go. All right, Jack is uh, taking a phone call in the car and I am impatient. So we are gonna head into this RH outlet and get started. I'm so excited. Every time I come up here, I'm just like, why does this place just have to just make me so happy? It's just, it's so much fun to get to see so many things in one place and they're discounted. <laughs> Maybe it's just that, it's the thrill of the hunt and the discount. It really does save a ton of money. So here we are, let's go. And we are off. And I am so excited to tell you guys that this store was absolutely packed with beautiful items. It's probably the fullest that I've seen the store in a few years. They just had so many collections that I love. So I'm excited to point out to you some of my favorite collections that I think you should 100% be shopping for when you're shopping at RH. And if you happen to have an outlet near you, you're gonna love it because they really do discount things significantly at the outlets. You can see here where you're looking at a lot of times the price is about 50% off. A lot of times it's even less. You've got that Russian oak, that distressed wood collection. I was just looking at that French contemporary here. I think that's the Maxwell sofa. It's one of my favorites for sure. Then over here, they had one of my favorite tables. I love anything that has that brass and the brown. I think that combination is really, really pretty. I also love the reclaimed oak collection. Here you've got the beautiful media cabinet. Again, heavily discounted. It's beautiful. Every one of these pieces just has that sort of rawness to it. That mixed with the linen throw like this is just a beautiful combination. And I know a lot of you have the brown uh, leather like this and I think it still works especially if you if you use it with something that just kind of throws off the balance a little bit like these reclaimed wood collections I think it can really look updated so if you have those pieces don't don't get rid of them just yet maybe just think about maybe adding in a piece or two with them here you've got the massive cloud of course it's beautiful and amazing I've got eyes for the French contemporary and the chagrin these are the collections that I personally just absolutely love. I have one of the chagrin pieces and actually have two chagrin pieces from them and I just love them. They're so high quality. The campaign collection, amazing. Bezier collection that I also have in my own home and I love the color tones that are in that collection. Here's more of the campaign collection. It's one of my favorite. I love the black like that. It really is just so beautiful and with, mixed with the brass, it just gets me every time. It's a little bit more traditional, but I love it. Here you've got some of the little French collections, some more chagrin. I mean, was I telling you the truth? It's packed with things. So many, so many things to see. I have been looking at these cabinets for absolutely years and I love them. I will tell you that I noticed that they were on sale 
on the RH website. As you're gonna see, I go back to the same collections over and over. These are the ones that really, really interest me. But what I love about going to the outlet is that you get to see the wood tones in so many different collections. And a lot of times when you're in the store or in the gallery, you really don't get to see everything in person. And here at the outlet, you really just have so much variety that you're able to see so many different collections, all the different colors, and it offers you so much in savings. I've bought so many pieces from the outlet and sometimes they come with dings, sometimes they come in perfect condition. So you really have to do shop around quite a bit. But as you can tell, I have a thing for the Bijer collection. I keep showing it to you over and over, but they really do just have so many great collections. And one of the things that I go back to over and over with Restoration Hardware or RH as they like to be called now is the color tones of the wood. That is one of the things that for me, I just absolutely love. I love the sort of washed out gray color tones that they put into their wood pieces. And I do find that a little bit harder to replicate from other brands. And I think that's why for me, I just keep coming back to it because it's just literally what I want. And I think that's pretty cool. One of the things that I noticed when I was in the RH gallery last time was how beautiful the linens were. And I have some of their stone washed linen and it is so soft. And the longer I've had it, I've had the duvet that I have from them. I've had it for years now and it just gets softer and softer and it's just so durable. And so I know that they do come in sometimes at a little bit higher price point than other places you might shop, but the quality is just gorgeous. And I really, you can see, I'm just touching everything. I just want to like check it out for you guys and decide whether it just passes the luxury test. And time and time again, their, their linens just really do because they really do strive to give you a quality product. The colors are absolutely gorgeous. And this is why for me, I find myself just gravitating back here to shop. I was looking at the towels and that's because I've been thinking about investing in some towels and just going for a whole set all at once. I, I told you guys in a recent video, one of the things that I've done by mistake was buying a one-off, one-off towel, maybe two, but not doing a whole set. So I've been thinking about that and I love looking at their, again, just looking at all their bedding, it is gorgeous. So if you're at the outlet, honestly, even if you're at the gallery, I would check out their linens because they really do just take your bed over the top. One of my favorite things about the outlet is that they do actually get quite a bit in from the teen selection. So if you look at this store, if you look on their website or you get their catalogs, they have their furniture broken down by different collections. And the teen collection is actually the scale is actually a lot smaller and the prices a lot of times are almost half what the other collections are from the adult the the adult section so i suggest checking out their teen whether it's online or on the outlet a lot of times they put the stuff that's in the outlet they've got it on sale on the website so even if you don't have an outlet near you i would just suggest looking at the sale section. The great thing about it is that a lot of times if you buy it on the website, you do actually get a warranty because you can see here, I was struggling to get the drawers to work. So that's part of buying in the outlet. You might get it 70% off. You're just gonna have to decide whether, you know, pushing that <laughs> and whether that's gonna work is gonna be a good option for you. Or maybe it's something that you can fix. Sometimes I've found things that I'm like, okay, I can just fix whatever's broken and 70% uh, off saved me a ton of money. But yeah, I just wanted to walk you guys around a little bit. Here's actually something from the kid and baby selection, but the top of that piece comes off. It's a changing table, but you don't need it. So this collection is infinitely less expensive. It's also scaled down. So if you have a room that's small, maybe you only have room for a small dresser, I would suggest looking in the children's, I think they call it kid, kid and baby, child and baby, yeah and then they have the teen collections. So I think you can find some amazing deals that way. I couldn't get over just how many different collections were actually in store. It, this is just the most I've seen and you've got everything from their mirrored 
side tables, you've got Reclaimed, you've got the Raffia collection. These are all that I'm showing you, I do believe from their teen collections. So, you know, $4.90 for a side table instead of, you know, $1,800 or $2,000. It's just a totally different thing. So I definitely love the Chagrin. I've bought a piece from them, uh, from the outlet for my daughter's room in, in the Chagrin, and it's really, really held up. My 17-year-old son, he also has pieces from them, and they've really held up to wear and tear because I know if you're giving a, you know, a, a quality piece to your kids, it does tend to come with a higher price tag and it can make people nervous, but uh, these pieces just have really held up for us, and so I highly recommend them. I thought we could also take a peek in the outdoor section. They had so much outdoor. It was so inspiring i love to get to see some of these tables that i've never seen in person they've got something that was from the contemporary collection they've got a really good mix of items and so i just love seeing these i love their outdoor collections i love that they have something that's really rustic they have things that are a little bit more traditional and then at our store this is very close to the rugs so i just absolutely love the rh rugs they do typically come with a much higher price tag. Sometimes I, I like almost can't breathe <laughs> when I see the price. But I was surprised that actually a lot of them are less expensive than I expected them to be. And they've got so many pretty ones. I really loved this collection. I mean, 2200 for a 9 by 12 for the quality that you're getting is actually a really good price it is because that's what i do right i shop in the luxury market i can tell you that a lot of times these are way more than that but you're getting a wool rug the the weight of them and the thickness of these is not just your average rug i also love to just be inspired by their fabrics and what they chose yeah you can tell that that one was silk you see me running my hand over the silk ones over and over because they are so soft and so for me, even when I'm just looking around, I just love seeing what catches my eye. What is it that I really like? Maybe I hadn't thought about a certain style before. And so even if I'm not shopping specifically for something, to me, just being able to check out the fabrics and, and the colors and all that kind of stuff can really just inspire a whole new design. And yeah, I thought you guys would like to see how many different rugs they had. It was just glorious actually <laughs> i was kind of in heaven look at that silk again beautiful absolutely beautiful one of the things that i love to shop for at rh is their planters because they make some amazing planters some of them they are amazing and they have a price to match them and others are more affordable so I would check out their sales section if you don't have an outlet near you because some of them are as heavy <laughs> as a car. I mean, they're just, they weigh a ton. And so uh, you really end up paying, I think, a little bit more. They also have a beautiful selection of outdoor tables and I just think that they're just gorgeous, but it was this planter that I had my eye on and <laughs> It weighed a million pounds. Okay, not actually a million, but it felt like it. But actually 270 for that piece was a pretty good price because if you try to buy those even at a garden center, they're gonna easily cost you that much. So sometimes you can find really good deals. I wanted that piece, but I didn't really have a place for it. Here you can see I'm checking out their lanterns. They have gorgeous outdoor lanterns. I love them. Yeah, I mean, what's not to love, right? <laughs> it's all so pretty, and I just felt like the store was just completely packed with all gorgeous items, but yeah, the lanterns are spectacular, and it's a really fun thing to add, and they were 80% off, so I just didn't need any. Oh, and look at this little baby. I just about died. <laughs> so cute. Then I thought we could head over to the table area. I was on the hunt for a table. I've been looking for my own house, here you can see I got distracted by one of my favorite coffee tables of all time. Oh, love those marble coffee tables. I do love the X base, but I don't think that's the one that ultimately I want for my own house. But I was checking the price. Can you tell? I do love it. But they have so many that it's really hard to kind of choose. So uh, here you can see I'm like, oh, hi, in the mirror. <laughs> 
they have a great section at our store of accessories. I didn't see anything that I had to have. I really want these rings, but the small one is still $620. That's maybe a little bit out of my personal range, but uh, I was checking to see if they had anything else, and honestly, they didn't really have anything that I thought was worth taking home. So here, we're getting a little peek of the living room area. You can see again, I love this table. The T-Brace collection is one of my favorites. And you've seen it in two colorways today, and I love them both. This is not my favorite sofa. It's a little firm, but yeah, not my favorite. But over here, we're back looking at mirrors. I noticed that they had my leather chairs. And look at their lighting. I loved the chrome lighting. I thought that that was gorgeous. I really love this lighting. I love the way that it just sort of sparkles, but it feels really, really modern. I also love a lot of their lamps. This is where I've gotten my own, and they discount them significantly so I again check at your outlet check online but these lamps I just love how they add that little bit of down lighting and it just I don't know it just warms the room and it warms your little seating area and it is actually practical if you'd like to sit and either read or look through a magazine while everybody else is watching a movie the Italian shelter sofa literally one of my favorite pieces sold by RH I've never gotten to actually see it in person and getting to see the sofas. I have the chair, but I'd never seen the sofa. And I wanted to buy this for my personal, for my primary bedroom. And it was just too big. And I just love those pieces. So getting to see them in person was pretty fun. But also look at this. I'm like, ah, <laughs> look at this piece. Beautiful shagreen bar cabinet with spectacular marble. Oh yes, I really thought about taking that home. Kind of regretting not taking it home with me. I do have a spot and my husband is obsessed with bar cabinets. Ah, oh, why didn't I take it home? Okay, well you live, you learn. But there you go, another peek at the shelter collection. Mm, beautiful, Thaddeus was there, lots of clouds, lots and lots of chairs and sofas. And I just, there's just not any here that I just don't really like. I just really love them. I love the colors again and Love them when they have the metal. And here's Jack. Hi. Hey. I've been having fun without you. <laughs> I'm having fun all by myself oh. and all my friends. <laughs> I wish they had more of these. I know. They don't feel like they have enough. I really just feel like maybe they just need more of that table. <laughs> Does make a very bold statement all lined up like that. Do you think they're discontinuing it? I wonder what they I used it for. Have, I should go up to them and say, I wish you had 14 of these. <laughs> they have 13. <laughs> if only there were, there were 14, 14, I'd buy I'd them all. Buy them all. With the price tag of oh, 1300 They would catch me because what? there's number 14. Oh, oh well, there <laughs> you go. go buy them. We'd be in trouble. <laughs> <sighs> yeah, this place just makes me so happy. They have a lot of stuff in here. They do. It's really full of really good oh, I've stuff. Never, I haven't seen this for a long time. I know. It's so good. It's a great piece. Yes. Well, you know, I have a thing for the chagrin. So the. I don't even, do. I don't even know. Just been looking. We've just been looking. We've just been perusing. Perusing. We have been perusing and you having and fun. You all three hundred thousand plus of our friends. Yeah, we've been having fun. We've been having <laughs> a lot of fun. We've been looking at mirrors and lighting and rugs and outdoor and dining. <laughs> I know that's not all the damage we just did. <laughs> no. Most of what we bought will not fit in this bag. No, it will not. <laughs> but uh, I was taking one last peruse through, just Nothing seeing else. everything. I, I want it all. There's a lot of fun stuff. It's just all gorgeous. So uh, yeah, it's exciting. Oh, well, back out into all this gorgeous sun. I know. It's so bright, it, like, it's blinding. And it's nice heat. It's, not it's like warm, but it's not boiling. Yeah. So that's a pretty big change. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna, you wanna show uh, a little peek of what's in our bag there? Got a little set of their towels. I wanna test them out before I buy a whole bunch of them. Cause I'm picky about my towels. <laughs> <laughs> and I've just been trying to find something where I could just buy like one really beautiful set and just be done. 
Yeah. For like a really long time, and I haven't found anything. I feel like sometimes they just move water around. <laughs> yes, and they're like they need... squeegees on your body. And yeah. You're like, but the water's I'm still wet. But I also want it to be soft. It needs to do what a towel is supposed to do. I mean, come on. Yeah. Right. Um, but yeah. So we bought a couple pieces of furniture. We didn't find everything, but that's how it is. So now we'll just have an excuse to come back, so. All right, guys, we are back in the car and we thought it'd be really fun to share with you what we are gonna be up to this weekend. One of my favorite things to do on the weekends is to strip all the beds in the house and go through and just clean all the linens and restyle up the beds. So I think having fresh, gorgeous sheets on the bed is just amazing. And I'll leave a suggestion for you of some of my personal favorites and I love to buy a really nice detergent. I like to have a nice stash of those things because it just helps me really just get the job done quickly. And of course, we're gonna have some me time. I've got a stack of books that I'm excited about. I always like to share one of my favorite books because there's so many amazing books out there and I just love to be inspired and re really rejuvenate myself. One of the things that I've started to do every weekend is really take time for my skincare. It's something that I've really, really started to do every single weekend because I really don't have time to do anything too major during the week. But now that I've gotten the Ona Diamond Facial Brush from Towel Clean, it's quickly become something that I really like to do over the weekend. I know a lot of you said that you have actually ordered one and you're already loving it, but if you haven't, my discount code is still good and you can get 60% off with my discount code Valentina. It really just gives your skin a nice deep clean and it just leaves you feeling, it just leaves you feeling so fresh and clean. So this weekend, I think it's time for us to do a fresh order of coffee. We have been yeah. drinking a lot and it's that cool time of the year when you can drink hot in the morning and cold in the afternoon. So I think it's time to place an espresso order and I see think what so new too. stuff they have. And everybody always asks me what my favorite pods are. And the truth is, is that I, I just, I love the variety of yeah. the Nespresso machine. It's something that it's, I, I, can't, I don't know how I would live without it. Like I would literally have a complete lifestyle change <laughs> if I didn't have my Nespresso machine. Like we're going home right now and I'm going to be making my coffee. Like it's just a part of our life. And yeah, I just really love it. Some of my favorite pods, if besides the fact that I just love the fact, I love trying all the different ones. But if I have a go-to and I'm like, I'm, you know, want something that I just know I'm gonna love, the vanilla ones are my ride or die. I love them because they have a nice little vanilla flavor. So it tastes extra sweet, even though it doesn't have any extra calories. But then the India one is, uh, that has been one of my favorites since literally, I think we've had our machines now for about eight years. I think so, yeah. yeah. That one was one of my very first ones that I fell in love with because the crema that it gives you is literally the closest that you can, I think you can get to an Italian espresso. I mean, it's just so good. I just literally want to like stick my finger in it and lick the crema. It's it's that <laughs> good. It's that good. And Jack's favorite is actually the ristretto. It's always been your favorite. So. And right now they have a, a cold brew with lemon in it. Yeah. I don't even know if they have any more of them. I don't know if they're still available, but we'll link up all those little flavors for you. And um, we like the Breville that we have because everything's incorporated. It looks really good sitting out. But every machine that we've ever bought from Nespresso is amazing. There isn't a machine that we don't love. So we and we own five, five, <laughs> five of them. We put them in places like we put one in my sister's. We bought one for Haley to every, take to college, and she's still home. Every project gets every project one. Gets one. Every kitchen gets one. It's just because it's the most amazing thing ever. So, well, the sun is uh, beaming down and uh, I'm gonna turn the air conditioning up in the car, which you guys will make it, it'll make it harder for you to hear. So uh, we hope that you guys have a wonderful weekend. Uh, hopefully a, a great week. Don't forget to tune back in on Sunday. We'll have a new video for you, waiting for you. We've got some really exciting stuff coming out in September. So make sure you hit subscribe. All the content is coming to you very soon from Ty Pennington's project. It's happening. It's filmed. It's coming at you. And if we can get all the details worked out, we have a very fun surprise coming very soon. And because we have hit 300,000 subscribers, we have a very fun way of celebrating. And as soon as we get all the details worked out, we're going to be announcing it to you guys. So it's a really big deal. It's I'm 
huge. Excited. I'm so excited. I'm a little scared. I, I'm, I'm like. It's usually how we approach most things. <laughs> I'm always scared and I do it anyways. It's one of those moments. It's a really big deal. Yeah. So, um, yeah. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. Hit subscribe. And uh, have a great weekend. We'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Bye.